fucking look here. Just come across to me. Now I wonder if you've ever questioned your ability or inability to talk to God. Or the Our Father, as I call him. Or the gods. Because he has, whether well, you look at it, Archangel, Michael, do his bidding, they are all gods. See, the Vikings always had names for these gods, and they're all gods. We call it Satan, or whatever you call this. Listen, as human, I have questioned my ability to talk to the All Father. But now, I do not. He talks directly to me and through me. In ways you don't know, in the ways that almost drive you insane because no he's never talked to me in that way. When you told me, the people told me I was not good enough. The All Father always told me you are good enough. When I was laying on the ground and I wanted to die and I prayed to the All Father, please take my life. Let me just come be with you. He said, it's not your time. Well, now, most of you have been running, have been running, and including me, been running from the All Father, from God, or God's, as I call him. There's many faces to God, and what I realize about the All Father is, and the Viking gods, is there female and male faces of God. See, that's where gods come in. Because it can't just be one voice, because he is many and alpha, omega, everything. You see, when he sent me, I had many faults, and I still do. I still have many faults, but I'm working on those things. And I say to you, so can you. Forgiveness is one of the greatest gifts of God or the All Father. But if you need it. And many times in my life I look back and I really didn't need it, but I always ask to look here. See, every time you look in the mirror, you look in the face of God. Each and every single one of you. So if you don't feel good here and you can't sleep at night, then that. Is God telling you? Listen to that dark voice. Because the face of God is much more beautiful than that. And every star in the watchers that are watching us. The South Star, the North Star. Aries, Orion. They have come down here and interfered. And they have asked you all. And gave you instructions on how to be human. And what it was like when you thought about the God of the underworld. These things. Ancient aliens. Whatever the fuck y'all want to talk about. The old father says. He forgets you. Read between the lines people. Read between the lines. My promise to you, from now on, is I'm no longer crawling upon the ground. You may see me fall upon down on that path, but I fell there for 50 years, but no longer will I fall. For I only look at the stars, and I'm looking up, and that's where I'm going. So even if you see me crawling on the ground, I am not on the ground or underground, not as of yet. We as a people have to, the voice of the people are as important. And I see many 
going a different path, breaking those curses, those family curses that has held us to this ground way too long. It's time we start thinking for the stars, people. We start reaching for the stars, and I don't mean that in this ground earth body sense. Let's start reaching for the stars because we got to start thinking bigger and better than all these motherfuckers that are tying us to the ground. We got to think greater and better than every single person that brought us down before this. Why did we keep repeating <laughs> what's the definition of insanity people to keep repeating the same thing in cycles over and over again and we keep giving names but it's a name for the human condition 